Good morning, Riverview. I'm Abigail. This is your Shark News. Congrats to FFA and their great showing at last week's team competitions. Vegetable judging came in sixth and will move on to state finals. Food science came in 21st and environmental science came in 31st. Well done. If you are interested in joining Freshman Steering, there will be a meeting tomorrow, November 9th at 8 a.m. Or stop by and see Mr. Farron in room 305. The next flood drive is on November 18th. Sign-ups will be 15th through 17th during all lunches. Seniors, get out your calendars and mark these dates. Grad Bash at Universal Studios is Friday, April 1st from 7 p.m. to 2 a.m. Tickets and transportation will be 170. Also, prom is Saturday, May 14th from 7 to 11 p.m. at Rigant's. Start planning and saving now. In sports. Congrats to our four volleyball players that made Western Conference. Hannah Bowers, Brooke Arnold made first and team, and Reagan McConomy and Pam DeJesus Tredor made second team. Also, congrats to the girls cross, cross country team for qualifying for regionals. Gia Palazzo's made and set a season PR. Well done to the whole team. Reminder, there will be a track and field meeting right after school today in the driver's ed room. Soccer's first match are on Friday at home against Leto, starting at 6. So we, al we also talked to the coaches about the upcoming season. Take a look. So what are you expecting with this upcoming season? Um, well, I'm expecting to have a good year this year. We have a, a handful of our boys returning from last year that have some great quality. And we have a few new guys coming in that are bringing some extra quality as well. So we're hoping that chemistry coming together. Um, hopefully we're bringing home some trophies at the end of the year. That would be good. And um, how do you think this season will um, differ from last year, you know, with all the COVID that happened? Yeah, COVID was crazy. You know, last year we started off our season with half our team quarantined for our first few games. Nightmare. So hopefully we'll just have uh, all of our boys at our disposal this year as things get going. Um, and hopefully that in itself will be a little bit stronger. Um, yeah, so we'll see how the boys just kind of go from there. And when's your first game of the season? Our first game is November 12th against Lado. All right, thank you for your time, Coach. Yep, you're welcome. So what are you expecting with this upcoming season? Uh, we had a good group of girls out for tryouts, so uh, we, you know, it was hard to make our cuts, but uh, it was exciting to have enough girls out there. So we had 25. We're expecting good things. We'll see what happens. How many of those players are returning? Uh, we have about 12 or 13 returning from last year. That's good. And how do you think um, the season will differ from last year with the, all the COVID that happened? So I think a lot more girls would come out this year, which was nice. Uh, we have a good mix of girls. Um, we have some good talent, but we're just kind of looking to kind of build uh, a little bit of team chemistry going on and into the season. So. Right. And when's your first game? Uh, first game is next Friday. So I think that's the 12th or the 16th. I'm not sure. I think it's the 12th. But we play Leto at home, 8 o'clock for the girls, 6 o'clock for the boys. So come on out on a Friday night support. It'd be great. So. All right. Thank you, Coach. No problem. Thanks. Go Sharks. We'll have more sports reports as winter sports gets going. If you haven't yet, subscribe to our YouTube channel to get web exclusive videos as well as catch up on our announcements if you are absent. In arts and entertainment news, congrats to the theater department for getting five Broadway star on the future nominations, Madeline Gonzalez and Sophia Luna for outstanding performance in a play, Aiden Finnegan and Austin Stanley for outstanding supporting performer in a play, and Miss March for outstanding director Direction of a play. Up next for theaters and all together now, a show featuring your favorite songs from your favorite musicals performing November 12th and 13th at 7 p.m. Finally, there is still time to sign up for Poetry Jam on November 16th with a special guest, Skitty. If you like to write poetry or want to learn to write poetry, this is for you. Look at the QR codes around campus. For Shark, T Shark TV, I'm Abigail. Have a great week review. Thank you.